I love coming out here in late autumn and throughout winter. It's like I'm in, uh, well, not only the tropics, but it gives a jungle feeling. Today we're going to check out this guy here, the uh, Inga, also known as the um, ice cream bean. The ice cream bean tree, which uh, is normally found in the northern parts of Australia, in the tropics and subtropics. Well, now you can also find it in the, in the southern part of Australia, here in Melbourne. I've had this guy growing for five years. And it seems like a few of them are ready to, to pick. It's probably best to pick them from the ground when they fall. And as you can see, they're all different sizes. Uh, these are like young. And these ones are like um, halfway. And these ones are look ready and believe it or not there's also ones that are flowering still yeah so flowering ice cream beans for six months of the year the first one came in um, December and now we're uh, only a few days away from June and they're still flowering so Wow all right, let's grab a couple and um, check them out. They're pretty small, these ones, but that's all right. We just want to taste this, not a competition on size. There you go. One, two. They're cute, aren't they? Okay, here we go. Check these ones out. This is like a makeshift location in a container where I'm growing bananas. So, ooh, that looks good. There's one. Two. And three. All right. And the one in the middle seems to have a sprout. Okay, let's have a taste test now. Oops, one of the seeds fell out. Mmm, mmm, good. Very good, sweet. Wow, they're getting sweeter and sweeter with each one. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed that video on the ice cream bean tree or ice cream bean fruit, also known as the Inga fruit in um, Central and South America. Okay, the sun just came out as I was getting, to wrap it, getting ready to wrap it up. So you can see now with a blue sky what it looks like, a bit more um, color. It's quite a beautiful tree, very attractive, even if the fruit was subpar, it's actually overpar. I have this um, sugar cane growing here, but I'm going to trim the, the ice cream bean tree next summer, once we collect all the fruit, so that the sugar cane has got room to, to um, grow. Yeah. 
so a lot more colorful now with the sunshine that's the um, the custard apple tree next to it and the tree is four meters actually it's between four meters and five meters it's quite a big tree beautiful tree with delicious fruit so this is gonna be our um, go-to tree over winter remember winter is not the end of the world when you're growing tropical fruit it is if you're growing only apples and pears so if you can plant as many tropical fruit trees as you can if you're in temperate climate or subtropics all right thanks for watching guys i really love sharing these um these videos don't forget to subscribe and like